I'll record. All you gotta do is keep me in the window. My name is Tom. I pray for people and they get healed quite often instantly. Do either one of you guys have any pain or sickness you need healed? You, you need something healed. I can tell. I can tell sometimes when I'm near somebody with pain or sickness in their body, I'll get like a tingly feeling in my hands. I just felt it right here. You have pain somewhere in your body, right? Mostly, yeah. Yeah, isn't that amazing to do that? And I don't know you. Here, why don't you hold this? Did you, can you hold that for me? Que lo puede aguantar. Oh, you understand? Yeah, just it's on record. All you can do is snap. All right, now, do you, is you have, you have pain in your knee? Uh, no. No, where, where is it? In your back? Well, yeah, mostly. Okay, how long have you had that pain? About like almost five years. Almost five years? How did that happen? When I got hit by a car in seventh grade, when I was with my dad uh, working. Okay, so like when you get hit by a car, here, why don't, why don't you come over here? When you get hit by a car, sometimes there's a spirit of trauma that comes into you. All right? You know what that? You know what a spirit is? Yeah. Like an unclean spirit, like it will come into you when you get into an accident or something like that at that point of impact. And it sticks with you and it causes you to have pain for a long time. All right. And it's in your back. Okay, so watch this. Come here in front of this. You, you hold this up in the air like that. Right there, so that we get it on, so we get evidence of it. So, right now, your spirit of trauma, loose a hold of him right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Go, spirit of trauma, get out of him. Pain, go. Now, move your background. What's going on there? Just feeling a pain right here. <laughs> Did you feel anything go away? Did you feel anything going into your back when I tapped your back? Mostly, yeah. Yeah, you felt something going in there. Yeah. Yeah, go like this. Move, it, move around a little bit. Is the pain going away? Mostly, yeah. Isn't that amazing? Yeah. <laughs> It's, it's just a heel. I'll tell you what, I'll hold that. Do me a favor. The reason why I record it is to get evidence of how God loves people. All right. Now, now, when you when I tapped your back, you felt power going into your back? Mostly, yeah. And, uh, and the, if the pain level was a 10, what is it now? I think now it's like a 3. It's like you a know, 3. Yeah. And you had that pain every day for how many years? For 5. For 5 years? Now, aren't, isn't that amazing? Yeah. Aren't you happy about this? Mostly, yeah. <laughs> Do me a favor. Do me a favor. Like, you know, do you believe in Jesus? Yeah. Okay, great. Do you do you feel as if you have a personal relationship with him? Yeah, of course. Good, good, very good. You know, you're a very humble man. I can see it on your face. The Bible says that faith without works is dead. Do you know that scripture? Yeah. Okay, so like so like if you believe you're healed, then you would do something to like show evidence that you're healed. In fact, you do you would do something that that would normally cause pain. That's what faith is. Do you get that? Yeah. Okay, so so jog to like that board, that wall sticks out right there and back. So jog? Yeah, so jog to there and back. Right. Okay, now, where's the pain level? It's nothing now. I don't feel like it. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that incredible? <laughs> Give me a high five. Dude, it's amazing. You had that for, you said five years. Yeah. And it's all gone. Mostly, yeah. Yeah. It, it's all gone or is it a little? Well, I get a little, but now it's getting, I feel like it's uh, fading away. You feel like there's none there. Yeah. Yeah, like touch your toes and come on back up again. And then come on back up. And, and that feels good? Yeah, actually, it stretch out my back a little. <laughs> it stretch out your back. And so there's no pain there. Nope. Amazing. Or, now, does that help you believe in Jesus more? Yeah, it does, actually. Amen, because when you see the power of God and you experience the power of God, it helps you to understand that he's alive, that this is a supernatural life that we live. And all I did was tap your back and tell the spirit of trauma to leave you, right? Yeah. Isn't that all I did? That's incredible. God bless you, brother. God bless you, too. And you know what? I also want to bless you. I want to bless you with, with 20 bucks, too. Here, I love blessing young Let me get this out. I love blessing young people in... Uh, and, and that, oh, that's twenty dollars. Twenty dollars, right there. I love oh, blessing. You You're much. welcome. Did you need that twenty dollars? Actually, I actually did need it. Eh? Praise God. That is so awesome. So God gave me the opportunity to minister healing to you, who belong. You believe in Jesus. You love Him. You serve Him because I can see the humility on your face. He healed you, and He also gave you twenty bucks. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> now, see, I record it because. Because this situation's amazing, and so I like to teach people. So can I use this to teach people? Of course, you can, if you want. All right, God bless you, brother. Does he understand this? 
Mostly, he 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 knows more Spanish than English. That's why. Make sure you share the whole situation with him. All right. Tell him everything that just happened that I was saying in English, so that it encourages him to believe also. All right. Don't worry. Okay. All right. All right. God bless you, bro. All right. You too. All right. Bye. God bless you.